What's going on guys? Coach Bree here. We are back again guys. So today earlier I was doing pull-ups. Today is normally like a back day for me. So I was doing pull-ups earlier in the gym and now I'm here to finish the rest of my workout guys. So this would be a great opportunity. You could go for a walk before you do this exercise. You could do the walk after. You could use this as a supplement after your original workout. You could kind of mix and match depending on what you're trying to do. But this workout, we are gonna focus on the back. We're gonna focus on the hips and we're gonna focus on the glutes. So we're gonna do this again. We're gonna do two circuits, okay? The first circuit, will be um, a more back. Um, our second circuit will be more hips and glutes and maybe more like lower back. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna break down the first circuit, just those exercises, I'm gonna break it down real quick and then we're gonna dive right into the circuit. So just to let you know, we're gonna be moving 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off, and we're just gonna rapid fire for four rounds, guys. Four exercises, four rounds, and we're gonna be rocking and rolling. So our first exercise, well, really our first, our equipment, we're gonna be using a set of dumbbells, we're gonna be using a kettlebell and free space, okay? And I will give alternatives to these exercises. So first up first, we're gonna work a dynamic movement. We're gonna be working kettlebells, okay? So nice and smooth kettlebell swings, coming down, pushing forward. Make sure you're on those heels, hips back, head and chest up as you come down. Don't swing towards the wall, swing towards the floor, and then just drive those hips forward. Kettlebell swing is our first exercise. Up next, using either just a kettlebell or using just a dumbbell, we're gonna be doing gorilla rows. So nice, good, wide base. We have our kettlebell right in between us, alternating as we go, reaching from the center, pulling towards the hip pocket, squeezing the back all the way back down, alternating as you go, 20 seconds. Right, 10 second press, 10 second break, quick sip of water. We're down to our next exercise of next, Sorry, I got to one knee too soon. We're still working the dumbbells. So if you're a beginner, you know, this is gonna be a lot of movement. You can work a lot of set of dumbbells. We're gonna be doing reverse flies, okay? Just one big thing you don't wanna do, you don't want your dumbbells here, and you don't wanna be rotating up towards the ceiling. You want your dumbbells more in front of you, rotating directly behind you. And our last exercise is easy and simple, is bird dogs. And this encompasses kind of like the whole back, the back of the shoulders, the lower back, the core, and more. Crunching in, alternating as you go. Strong extension, crunch, strong extension, crunch, guys. Okay, so that will start off our first round of exercises, guys. So get yourself ready, get your dumbbells, get your water, keep it close to you guys. Because once we start, we are not gonna stop, okay? So, I gotta set my Apple Watch because you know if you don't set it, it don't count. Can't have that happen. Okay, boom, boom. Okay, guys. So, get ready to start. All right, guys. Five, four, starting with our kettlebell swings, and go. Driving those hips forward. Keeping that head and chest up. If you don't have a kettlebell, you could just be using a dumbbell and swinging that. So, right? Swinging it if you don't have a kettlebell. Gorilla rows. Squeeze in your back each time. Nice, good extension, right? Squeeze. I'm not gonna lie, I was burning more than anything with my legs. Reverse flies up next. Squeeze. 
Yeah, strong extension, squeeze the back, squeeze. All right, guys, that was round one of four. Guys, if you have it, like, subscribe, and share. Back to work. You guys, you're not gonna find variety in your workouts like you will here. A gorilla rose up next. Guys, quality, not quantity. So, don't worry about a specific number. Worry about squeezing and working the back. I'm using 10 pound dumbbells right now. Round three. Right now, your back should be working. Your back should be talking to you a little bit. Say, hey. Just holding that position works the back. Keep that back posture, keep your form.
One more round. One more round. Come on, guys. Push through. Last round. One rep at a time. Keep breathing. Inhale. Exhale. Gorilla Rose, what am I doing? That's the last set. Okay, guys. So that's the end of our first circuit, guys. Take a break, sip of water, towel, whatever you gotta do. This next set is about to come quick. So let's hurry up and get back in position. I'm gonna start breaking down the next series of exercises. So like I said, today's a back kind of day, um, but we're also gonna incorporate the hips and glutes. So it's gonna be primarily hips and glutes, but if you do it right, it's gonna be a lot of lower back as well, guys. So first exercise, nice and simple. We've probably already done this before. We're just gonna do the donkey kicks or the scorpion kicks, however you might feel. So make sure your hands are underneath your shoulders. Make sure your knees are underneath your hips. Core tight, spine neutral, okay? Uh, we're just gonna be kicking the ceiling. Keep the, uh, keep the knee bent as you kick the ceiling. Don't arch or like manipulate the body to try and get your foot up. Just take what your body gives you, kick as high as you can. So up next, we'll just keep it simple as well. We're just gonna work fire hydrants, nice and smooth, same thing. Take what your body gives you, core tight, spine, neutral guys, okay? So up next, we're gonna do something a little bit more uh, challenging. So we're going to be on the back. We're gonna work, we're gonna work alternating glute bridges. Alternating as you go. One at a time, squeezing your lower back, trying to get as high as you can, pushing through the heels. The higher you get, the more effect it will have on your lower back, okay? And our last and final exercise, we are going to work just Superman. So lay flat on the floor, Folding up as high as we can, squeeze in the lower back, all the way back down, nice and smooth, guys, okay? So those are our four exercises. We have our donkey, we have our donkey kicks, aka scorpion kicks, our fire hydrants, our alternating glute bridges, and our supermans, guys. So let's not waste no time. Let's get back to it. It's hump day, man. We got stuff to do. We gotta get to our day. So let's just start this bad boy again. Boom. And with the donkey kicks and our fire hydrants, we are alternating as we go. So alternate. Boom. 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 Alternate. Kick the ceiling, keep the knee bent. Try your best to keep the core tight.
Fire hydrants up next, alternating. Right now, this might seem easy to some. Your back might be screaming and burning by now because of our first workout. But just do what you can. This exercise is gonna sneak up on you. My back is already burning. Talking to me a little bit. So on the back, we'll go for our alternating glute bridges. Try to squeeze your back each time. Okay. Superman's up next. Curving, trying your best to get the back and hips off the floor. If you can't do this, just do a back extension. struggling over here. My mat's popping up on me a little bit. So back to top of the order. Set two of four. Alternating donkey kicks. Keep the knee bent. Core tight. Hands underneath the shoulders. Knees underneath the hips. If you want, you can add some weight. Back to the top, three or four. Intense exercise, focus on quality. Stick in every move, get in that leg high up as you can. Fight and keep your core tight. Don't just passively do this. Get after it.
guys. Round three and four is almost done. We're gonna fly a little bit, Superman style. And then we're just gonna crank out one last round, and then we are home free. All right, guys. Last round. Keep the foot neutral. Almost free. <sighs> Driving through that heel, squeezing that back each time. Exercise in this workout. guys so great job today today was more of like a functional strength back total back lower hips glutes guys great job today guys we moved quick we got two work two circuits done guys i am coach Bree. please like subscribe and share if you like my workouts nothing but variety i promise you a certified personal trainer for eight years, guys. Guys, I will see you guys next time. Coach Bree, out.